It's kind of scary to think that somebody might be casing your house to find vulnerabilities. Lauren Rue says it was about 9 o'clock at night when a man claiming to be with ADT security showed up at her house near 48th and Decatur. He kind of went through his whole spiel of saying, you know, we're giving discounts to new homeowners and, you know, you would qualify for all this stuff and, you know, if I could just come in and we could go through the contract. Rue says she asked the white man in his 40s for a business card, but he didn't have one, so he left. The other thing that I noticed was that his shoelaces were untied and the zipper of his pants was down. Rue tells me others in her neighborhood also had people claiming to be from the security company at their door. But these suspicious sellers seem to be showing up all over the metro. I happened to call two of my clients that I recently closed on and one of them had, had an ADT person at their door. They already go, well, we already just we already just put a system in with you. And they're like, oh, you have? And so they walked away. So very odd. Mary Wrench is a member of the Omaha Area Board of Realtors. The board sent an email to all real estate agents to warn their clients of this possible scam. It's public information when a house closes, so the people can just look in the paper. So you just have to really be on guard, you know, with anyone that would either come to your door or knock on your door. An ADT spokesperson told me that these sell scams are happening all over the country. That's why the company has a section on its website to warn customers. And ADT says most cell reps make appointments and rarely go door to door, especially late at night. Now here are some safety tips from myadt.com. They include always ask for a company ID and do not let a sales rep into your home if you don't feel comfortable. Back to you.